Do I have a friend or two who would like to come forward? Well, I do. How are you? You guys doing good? Hey, um, yeah. So, are you uh, excited about Reformation Sunday? How many of you are Lutheran? <laughs> Boy, I'm a miserable failure. My gosh, have some work to do. Well, anyway, it's Reformation Sunday, which is the, the anniversary of the Lutheran Church. I thought you'd be excited. I have a little story to tell you about two people. This is one of those things where I, I got some stuff to use in the sermon, but I have no idea what the point is, which is not a big deal. So if you ever go to a church and try to get in and become a Lutheran, if you hear this noise, it ain't your place, okay? That means go find another church. <laughs> so you knock on the door and they... <sighs> Thanks, Linda. <laughs> anyway, I, these two people showed up at my doorstep the other day. So I got that and I got these two people here. Pilgrims, how about that? I asked them what their name was and uh, This lady, I asked her, and just the lady said, my name is Attitude. And his name is Gratitude. So welcome to Attitude and Gratitude. Well, anyway, they came, and they tried to find a church, and they heard it was kind of good to be part of a Lutheran church. And so anyway, they went to the first Lutheran church. And the pastor opens the door, a young, good-looking guy, it wasn't me, and uh, they said, well, we want to be Lutheran. And the minister says, well, you got to tell me, what does it mean to be Lutheran? And they said, we have no idea. You know what it is? Oh, you're just waving to your family. Okay, good. And they, she, he said, what does it mean to be a Lutheran? And they said, I, we don't know. And he said, well, you don't have a ghost of a chance of getting in here. Oh, well, you think you know what you're going to get already? <laughs> so anyway, they said, well, I guess we're not going to go to that church. So they, there was another church over here. So they, attitude and gratitude went down the street. They knocked on the door of this church. The pastor opens the door. And they said, well, we, someone said we should become Lutheran. And he said, well, do you have some money to give the church? You know, because you know how I am. I'm always asking people for money. And they said, well, we don't have any money, but we have pumpkins. Can we put pumpkins in the offering plate? Would you do that? And he said, well, you can't, if you're not going to give us money, you can't come in here. And so they went, oh, boy. They finally went to one more church. It was called Heartland. And they knock on the door. And Mike and Ruth come out. And they said, well, we heard it was uh, good to be Lutheran. And Ruth and Mike said, well, good luck here because I'm Baptist and he's Jewish. <laughs> but they said, guess what? It doesn't matter. And they said, what do you want to be Lutheran? Well, we heard that when you're Lutheran, when you go to church, every Sunday is like Christmas. Every Sunday, and isn't that the way it is here? Every Sunday is like Christmas. There's spirit and there's love in the air. And they said, are we welcome there? And they said, you're all welcome at Heartland. And they found a church home. And so that's what it means to be Lutheran. A little Baptist, a little Jewish, a little Christmas, divide by three, and out pops a Lutheran. <laughs> How about that? Now your friends are going to probably tell you what kind of churches did you visit, and I'm going to give you a little thing. So here we go. Remember that first church about not a ghost of a chance? Remember that? Let's give you a little reminder of that church. All right, here's the first church. And there was that other church that didn't 
want you to put pumpkins in the offering plate? Remember that? Yeah. Is it pretty obvious this sermon makes absolutely no sense at all? Good. <laughs> okay, well, here's a reminder of that, church. How about that? And then there's that beautiful church called Heartland, where it's like Christmas every single Sunday you go there. Maybe a little reminder of that church. Isn't this just a miracle? We're going to listen to a song about being a miracle. And guess what? I think there's enough here where as we listen to this song, that each one of you can take one of each. Are you excited? I love you guys. Welcome to the Lutheran Church. And you can go back to your seats and listen to our favorite song. Okay, good. You can take one of each. Oh, you're welcome. Very nice. Anybody else want to say thank you? Okay, good. Remember that attitude of gratitude, right? Okay. You like it? Take it. Take one of these. Oh, no. no, sure. Everybody happy? Okay, come here. Come here. You, you want your hug? Thank you, Doug. And by the way, Doug, you're a miracle, okay? All right. Well, our next hymn is the classic Reformation hymn that uh, we used to sing back in the old days. A Mighty Fortress is number 504. Number 504.